everybody, I'm Mrs. Wilkie and we're really excited that you decided to join us for art camp this year. I know it looks a little bit different and we miss seeing you guys in person, but we're really excited that you're here. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the book. And today I'm going to show you how to make a little bottle of Lucy's Potion. And we're going to make, we're gonna paint the bottle and we're going to attach it so you can wear it like a necklace if you'd like to. So, the things that you have in your kit that you got from us are a glass bottle. It might be little or it might be big, I'm not sure, but either way, it's gonna look like this. It has a cork in it. And you should have gotten a little screw with a round top, a piece of twine, a little tag that says Lucy's Potion, a paintbrush, and a bottle of glue. The things that you'll need to get from your house are what I have here. I have a paper towel just to keep my table clean to make sure I don't get any glue or paint on it. Um, I have a paper plate that I'm gonna be putting my glue on. And I got myself a little toothpick type thing, all right? And this is just gonna help me paint the bottle without getting my fingerprints all over it. But if you don't have one, it's completely okay. You can just hold the top and the bottom like this and paint. And if you get your fingers dirty, you know what? This stuff washes off real easy with soap and water. All right? Oh, you're also going to need some food coloring. Now I have gel food coloring because that's what I had in my house. But you can use whatever you have in your house. You could even use, if you don't have food coloring, you could use a little bit of paint. But food coloring works a little bit better if you have it. So it could be this kind or the liquid kind, but you're not gonna use very much at all. So the first step, the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your cork out of your bottle and you're gonna lay it on the paper towel just to keep it safe, okay? And you're gonna put your bottle down and I want you to put just a little bit of glue, I'm gonna show you how much, just about that much glue. It doesn't take maybe a little bit more. That's about all you'll need for the entire bottle, okay? Close up your glue so it doesn't spill everywhere. And take your food coloring, and I'm gonna put just the tiniest little dot right on top of my glue. Try not to touch the bot, try not to touch the food coloring to the glue, because we don't want to get glue all over the bottle. But, all right, this one doesn't want to work for me. There we go. So I just put a little tiny drop there. And now I'm gonna take my toothpick or you could do this with your paintbrush but it might work a little bit better with a toothpick and I'm just gonna swirl it around until all the glue is the same color okay really really simple and that's really all the glue that you'll need it's not it's not really messy so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna take the same end that I just stirred with and I'm actually gonna put it inside the bottle so watch I'm gonna flip my bottle upside down and this is just so that I don't have to touch it. Like I said, if you don't have a toothpick, you can just hold it like this, and that's not a problem. Your fingers just might get a little dirty. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna dip my paintbrush into my glue, and I'm just I'm gonna try not to get it on the bottom because I don't want it to stick while it's drying. But I'm just gonna swipe and put a really, really thin layer of glue all around the bottle. That's it. Okay. I'm not going to put it on the lip quite yet because I want to be able to hold it and spin it a bit. All the way around. And try as much as you can not to make any big globs because it will turn out much clearer if you don't have any globs. Okay. Or you don't have any big streaks. All right, so do you see that? I have a couple of globs in there from the inside, but that's okay. So then you just go around the edge, and this is where the toothpick comes in handy. And you just kind of twirl it until it's all painted. Just like that. Simple. Okay, now watch, I'm gonna do this carefully. I'm gonna touch the bottom. I'm gonna flip it over onto my plate and I'm gonna let it hang out there to dry for a little bit. Now the next thing that you can do, if you want, you don't have to, I did on mine, your little tag that says Lucy's Potion will come white. 
I decided to color mine blue to match my bottle. So you can do that if you want while your bottle is drying. Okay, and if you decide to do that, you can. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your little hook here, you're gonna take your cork top, and you wanna make sure that it fits right in the right way. All right, and you're gonna wanna twist it right into the cork top. I'm gonna take it out so it's easier, I can show you. You're gonna twist it right in. Sometimes it's easier if you twist the cork instead of the little tiny knob. And that's what it's gonna look like. All right, and then I'm gonna take my twine and the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna loop it right through my tag, all right, to make sure that gets attached. And then I'm gonna put it right through my little hole. And I'm gonna take the end, two ends together. Watch how I tie it. This is the easiest way to tie something. You're going to wrap it around two of your fingers Wrap it all the way around to the front and then through. And you've got a knot. Okay? And now both of both the cork and the tag are attached. And you can pop the cork right in the top. And you've got Lucy's potion bottle. I'll show you mine again that I did earlier. This one's completely dry. Do you see how it dries clear? Isn't that really cool? It looks like sea glass. All right, so you can wear it as a necklace. Oh, mine's a little, little, a little bit too small. All right, you can wear it as a necklace or you can just put it on your shelf or on your dresser. You could put stuff in it or you can just have it there to look pretty. All right, I hope you have a great day. Stay cool and have a great summer. Bye.